Hi guys, Snake Dotter here. Welcome to the world of the marvelous mistake. This is a stealth game, something totally different from my channel, but um, something that I saw at Eurogamer. I played this game at Eurogamer up in the uh, the red section upstairs, and um, yeah, I loved it when I saw it. It's by the same people that made Auto Online, which I featured on my channel, um, Wonderstruck, and the guys there have been very uh, very kind and given me an early copy of the game. The game itself isn't out till the 20th of November, so this is a little preview for you. Um, um, yeah, and it's a cute, it's a cool little game. I, I really like the the mechanics of it, how it works. Um, yeah, really, really enjoyed the few levels I've played. Haven't touched it at all since I've got the game. Literally, I've loaded it up this morning, um, and I'm going to record it now for you for the first time. I've played, I think I played two levels at the at Eurogame. I played the, the tutorial, and then the first level after that. Um, but I really wanted to buy this game. Now the guys helped me out by hooking me up early so I could get a little preview out. So what I've said to them is I will purchase the game when it comes out and give um, one of you viewers, one of the, hopefully the subscribers, a chance to win the game. So at the end of the video I'll explain how that's going to happen. But for now let's jump into the game and um, yeah, let's have a look at Miss Take. So here she is. Click left, left mouse button to move. Um, so we just click and she struts her way across. I'm heartbroken. This right here is where the world's best art should be. My lovely aunt's legacy to me, all here for the whole world to enjoy. But it's all been stolen from me, and there's nothing I can do about it. Nothing. Unless... Mm. So, her, her aunt's art that she's been left has been stolen, and we've got to get it back. Let's click here, 1 Osborne Street. I've decided to stop feeling sorry for myself, it's time to act. I really should be putting on a woman's voice, shouldn't I really? I'm going to get my aunt's treasure back. This is my best woman's voice. I'll be careful and start with just one collection. Okay, so we're going to head over to Osborne Street. Here we go. This is the tutorial level. So let's begin the heist and let's see how this game plays. So, you have to click. You click the mouse button and you walk. No other controls. There are going to be other controls added, I, un I understand. It's going to be like WSAND controls if you want to use that. And a spacebar or whatever. Or, or a controller, control support as well. But literally, you walk up to a painting and you, and you click. To whistle, click and hold the left mouse button where you are standing. Whistling will lure nearby guards. Okay, so let's walk up behind this wall. And uh, remember this bit. You hold down the mouse button and he, she whistles. He's going to walk around to the red circle. And we're going to nip the other direction and walk away. So you walk up to the painting. When you walk near it, it collects it for you. You haven't got to do anything else. You should just, just, just walk near it. Let's go through this door to the next uh, to the next painting quickly. Oh, for the, for the guard sees me. So you can see the little blue cone, that's his field of vision, a bit like a kind of other stealth games you may have played in the past. Um, so we need to lure him away. So let's lure him, let's lure him this way. We'll walk in front, he'll see us, and then we're gonna we're gonna go. Though that isn't the mechanic you've been taught yet. I don't know why I did that. I should actually just have whistled. Whistling and luring does the same kind of thing. Luring comes in the next level if I remember rightly. Anyway, but that's fine. We'll walk to the door. So we need to get to this door. We need to whistle to this guard. So let's stand behind the painting. Let's whistle here. Let's whistle like a bit further up here, actually. So he comes around. Cooey! So we're going to walk around the back of this wall. Hopefully he's going to go up the side of the passageway. And we're going to nip around behind him when he's not there. There we go. Look. So we can walk through quick. Now each level has a kind of uh, a time scale on it. And we want to try and beat that time scale. I don't think we're going to beat this one. But uh, let's go to the exit and jump in. Right, so... This is the second level of the building. Five more pieces of art. In the top right hand corner it shows you the art we've got to collect. This is showing you showing you the lure, the lure thing. So we've got to walk basically walk in front of this gap here, across here, and the guard's gonna see me and he's gonna follow. See the little hmm? He'll follow to where the last place he saw me, which is by that by that little doorway. So we're gonna sneak around the back and um, get out of here. So there's painting two. We're gonna do the same thing again. We're gonna walk in front of here. This second guard will see me. We're going to walk around the back, and we're going to nip him before he has a chance to see me. If you walk around while he still can see you, obviously he's going to spot you at a different angle. So don't want to go too quickly. There's another guard here. So we're going to go here and let him see me. There we go. And we're going to walk around the back while he's being all dozy and stupid. And we're going to nip through here. We're going to get out of here. Like I said, it's all one one mouse control. It's, it's nice and easy. Just click with the mouse, and uh, everything's done. Last two paintings are here. And we have the exit. Let's get out of here go right level three still more stuff guards movement patterns are unpredictable so hiding and waiting won't help use the techniques you have learned to lure them out of your way okay so we these guards are now some of these guards are walking they won't just stand still so if I whistle oh, I don't have to have to whistle here don't have to do it he's already gone so let's quickly do before he turns around so while he's look not looking we'll get out of here 
Can't go that way because I'm sure he's going to see me if I do that. He would have done probably there, wouldn't he? So let's quickly let that guard. That guard's seen me. So we'll sneak around there quickly while he's not looking. And we'll get these few paintings. Look, he's, he's given up. He hasn't seen me. Now that guard over there isn't going to move. He's stuck in the doorway. So I can... I can whistle him properly. No, I can't. He doesn't hear me. He's not going to hear me. He's too far away. Is he, is he interested? No, he doesn't want to come. Come on. You want to come. Of course you do. You want to follow me. There we go. Right, he's going that way. So we're going to nip out there. Get that last painting and head to the exit. Done. A job is a good one. <coughs> Excuse me. Flick of the hair and mistake is happy. So there we go. Tutorial. There's no, uh, no best time to beat on that one. Literally just that sort of gets you into the game nice and easily. So, the Artful Dodger. Let's complete that level. Let's go back to our gallery. When you get a painting, um, when you get a, a sort of level finish, you get a, a little newspaper. I saw this at, at Eurogamer. Prices Treasure Stolen. Okay, that's us doing that. So let's go to level two. Whitechapel. The best time to beat, or the best time to beat rather, is 1 minute 30. Let's see if we can do that. Right, so we can run by holding down the mouse button. Something new. Let's run over to this, uh, to this painting. Running obviously makes a noise, so you've got to be a bit careful. There we go. While he's not looking, we'll go in there. And we're going to whistle him, and hopefully he'll come around this way. And we can uh, we can get over here quick. Is he going to quickly? Is he going to see me or not? Let's get out of here quick, 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 quick. No, he's gone the other way. That's good. So we'll sneak in here and get that painting. And stay out of the way. They've only got a certain field of vision as well, so they won't they won't see you if you're too far away from them. But there you go. That's all the paintings done. That's five paintings. We're out of here. That was very quick. Let's get to the exit, up to the next level if there is one. Come on, in you go, love, into the into the uh, into the elevator. Oh, who's this guy? Let's go and see him. Who's he? I've been watching you. You're rather impressive. Why, thank you. What? Leave me alone, or I'll call security. Not a good idea. What do you mean? Who are you? You'll find out. Good luck, and see you around. Mm, okay, who's he? We don't know who he is. Let's quickly run across here. He's seen me, so he's going to lure that way. He's not going to have a clue. So let's go that way. He's seen me that way as well. Let's get into this corner so he doesn't see me anymore. Let's get that painting. We're going to walk along the back wall. And we'll go through here to this one. Because we're kind of like we're. There's only one guard on these levels. There's the exit. So let's get back across here. He can't see me. He's not going to find me now. So we can run pretty much. There we go to the exit. Flick of the hair, jobs are good and we're done. Level two sorted. Oh, look at that. Woo! Did it in one minute 15. 15 seconds quicker than the par. So I've got an extra trophy there. Fast. Brilliant. Another art theft. It's outrageous. I'm too rich to be robbed, says rich owner. You're never too rich to be robbed, sir. I'm like a modern day, um, a modern day uh, Robin Hood. Rich, stealing from the rich and giving back to the poor so they can see these paintings. Complete the level with as Sophia will recover a stolen gold painting for the gallery. Okay, click to continue. Should we do level three, Kensington? Let's give it a go. So the best time, or the time to beat rather, is 1.45. Let's see what time we can do it in. Oh, these, these, are, these are different. If a security camera sees you, it will set off an alarm and alert nearby guards. Now, I've not done this one before, so uh, let's see what we do. It will auto You will automatically crouch behind low cover. You can move while crouching, but you cannot sprint. Okay, right. So there's a camera here. So let's quickly go behind this, behind here. Then that I can't see me now. That's good. So when that goes back, we're gonna we're gonna sprint across to this to this room. Let's go there. Let's go there. Wow, that's very loud music. Very loud. I'll be turning this down for the game because it's very very loud. Let's sneak in here. Now, which way are you gonna come? You're gonna see me if I go in there. I hope not. Oh, you might see me if you come around here though. Let's. Go here. Uh, let's whistle here, and then we're going to go back this way. And hopefully, he won't see me. So we're going to zip through here. I'm going to grab these two. Let's get to the exit now. Where's the exit? The exit's up, up the top. So let's go up here. Oh, you've lost me, haven't you, poor man? Let's get to the exit quick. Is there another level? Yes, there is. Okay. Oh, he's back again. This guy. We meet again. You must stop following me around. You know. You again, the enigmatic one. Why did you wish me luck? People like us do need luck. People like us? What do you mean? Is he a thief as well then? I collected treasures like you without, shall we say, the owner's permission. He is, he is. Good grief, good grief. Keep your voice down. Good grief, what's that? 
It's all right, I'm on your side. Ah, okay, so he is a thief and he's going to help us, hopefully. Let's go around the back. Do what we'll do, we'll whistle here. No, we won't whistle here, actually. Because uh, I think he's going to come out anyway. Right. Oh, there's a camera here. Let's hide underneath the camera quick. Can I steal that painting while I'm standing there? Yes, I can. So what we'll do, we'll go back this way. And we'll see if he'll... Will he come out that way? Right, let's... Let's whistle here. Which way is he going to come? He's going to come that way. That's good. Right, let's quickly sneak in here then while... Well, let's get that painting while... Uh, He's not looking. Let's run over here quick. And let's go to the exit quick. We're out, we're out of here. Look at that. That's quick. Oh, do you know what? I just missed the time, I think. Look, 147. Ah, I didn't quite meet the time. But guys, that is where I'm going to leave it. Not too shabby was the comment I got. Okay, cool. Right, guys. So as I said, I'm going to give away one copy of this on Steam. If you like it and you've got PC and you've got Steam, please don't enter if you haven't because obviously all you're doing is taking the game away from someone that can actually play. Um, but yeah, all I do, all I want you to do is put the words Marvelous Mistake into the comments. Um, spell it correctly. If you don't spell it correctly, I'm not going to accept your, your entry. Um, and if you do spell it correctly, um, I'm going to choose one of you. Then at random, I will send you a comment um, on, or I'll send you a message on YouTube. A little YouTube inbox message to say you've won. And then you can just reply to me with your, your Steam ID or your email address. Your Steam email address, that is. And I can then send the, the game via a gift to you when it comes out on the 20th we'll keep this competition running until the 24th which is next Monday um, and uh, yeah good luck so if you want to win the game and you've enjoyed it leave comments say you've enjoyed the game but also leave a comment saying marvellous mistake and if you do that and I choose you you'll win a copy of the game thank you again to the guys at Wonderstruck for um, for giving me a copy of the game early hope you enjoyed and I'll see you again very soon cheers for watching bye